Hey guys, welcome back to Dino Domain. Now in today's video, this will be the best DNA guide to prepare you for this year's expensive error expansion. And out of all the DNA methods that I've uploaded, some have said I've sabotaged them because they got so much popularity. That isn't the case in this one. This is the most reliable and consistent DNA method there is on Dinosaur Arcade. Now before I get into the best DNA guide to prepare you for error expansion, click that share button. I want this video to get 50 shares. I'll leave this link in the description down below. Share it. Let's help everyone this year's error expansion. Anyways, let's get straight to this video. Now for this guide, the recommended dinosaur I'd choose would be the two Pandactylus. Shoots you back 37,500 DNA if you get all 12 fossils, or you could buy it for the full amount, 150,000. However, if you cannot afford the two Pandactylus, you can as well use the Ornithominus, which works equally as good using its double jump ability and its speed in general. And this dinosaur is free. Now, when it comes to this DNA method, the only downside is not doing it on a weekend. Not getting that weekend multiplier which doubles your DNA gains. But don't worry, you can do it on weekdays and it's still an extremely good DNA method. Now when you've selected your dinosaur of choice, me personally, I'm using the two Pandactylus. You can use the Ornithomimus, Eutheraptor, whatever floats your boat. But I think the two Pandactylus is perfect for traversing terrains in Dinosaur Arcade. Now you want to go onto rebirth cards and continuously roll till you get 30% DNA gain cards across all three. Meaning you'll have a 90% DNA gain. Now you can get 20% cards, but whatever is best for you. 20% cards are still very good by the way, but the icing on the cake is the 30% across all three. It works extremely well, and with a weekend buff, you can get 3.8 times DNA by completing standard missions that I'll go into. Now, do expect to spend a lot of DNA. Me personally, I believe I got quite lucky. I spent about 50,000 DNA and I got 30% gain XP across all three cards within this amount. But I'd say you'd probably be spending about 100,000 DNA to get all three cards 30%. However, don't stress. This is an investment and you'll come out with much bigger yields of profit when it comes to DNA. Now, while doing this broken DNA guide, with a weekend bonus with 90% DNA cards, you can as well get location bonuses just to add on to this, to get a near five times DNA bonus. See, so as you can see, when I eat this bush, boom, 4.75 times DNA. And you just go about this location. It's the redwoods for me. So I'm just going to go through every single mission and just grind it for as long as the location takes. And well, if you want to do this method safely without having the risk of worrying about other dinosaurs trying to kill you on your journey to grinding DNA, you can start up a private server, which is free by the way. You just click create private server and join. Now to make this DNA guide even better than what I've just said, I suggest you go to stats, upgrades, and upgrade the stamina. So when you're doing searching missions, we have to go through multiple bushes, like let's say out of eight, you just want to upgrade your stamina to, to the absolute cap, which will cost you about 75,000 or so. And doing that means that you're able to do more missions in a smaller amount of time than having to wait for your stamina to recover. And as well, I suggest you do not touch the stats that make it so your hunger and thirst doesn't deplete as fast. You want it to deplete, as there's certain missions that require you to use your hunger and to 
recover your thirst. So you want to make them always low as possible to just finish these missions as fast as possible. Now let's get straight into the statistics on how much DNA you can get from doing this guide. Now keep in mind I did not do location buffs and I got roughly 2.2 million within seven hours of just flying around doing missions in a private zone where I did not need to think about other dinosaurs attacking me. I got 2.2 million without needing to server hop, without needing to think about players stealing anything that's DNA valuable, such as my swim through guide, which apparently I terrorized a lot of you guys with this method, exposing it to the public. But I got 2.2 million safely, reliably, and consistently. And I got roughly 300,000 DNA per hour. Now, if you do it on a weekday, you'll get about 150,000. If you do it with location buffs, you can get about 350,000 DNA on a weekend. It varies, but at the end of the day, it's reliable. Don't need to worry about players taking stuff. It's just you and your missions. It's easy. So I think this is definitely an S tier DNA method guide. Now, last time I said, just share this video. Let's help everyone out. And if you want, you can distract people from like my swim through guide to watching this video. It'll help out both ways and in general, just the community. You know, I really care about the Dinosaur Arcade community. I want everyone to have equal opportunity at getting DNA so no one has issues with anything. That's why I do these guides. I do it for you guys. I'm not greedy. I don't like holding information back. And I'm willing just to share, give back to the poor. And just doing this guide for eight hours gives you everything you need for 2023 era expansion. It's such a perfect guide. I think it's the most consistent guide I have announced on my channel. And just to let you guys know, there is plenty more DNA guides I have in the making. It just takes an awful long time to create the video for it. But I will do it. I'll get to it eventually as the Dinosaur Arcade community needs help and I'm here to help you guys. So if you guys enjoyed this video, smash that subscribe button, share it for me please. And see you on the next one. Peace out, yo. Hey guys, I proudly present to you Dino Eater, an original series where dinosaurs will be rated from 0 to 100%. In today's video of Dino Meter, we'll be looking at